What's up everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope you all are well and this is the introductory video on the vehicle dynamics. In this video, you will learn what is vehicle dynamics, the flowchart of vehicle dynamics, vehicle dynamics approaches and the categories of vehicle dynamics. So without spending much time, let's start. So what is vehicle dynamics? So basically you are having a vehicle, you are having your car, your bike, truck or bicycle okay and you are interacting with it you are studying the motion of your car okay so studying it interacting with it understanding the behavior is vehicle dynamics so vehicle dynamics is a study of vehicle in motion and its behavior during the interaction with the driver simple the study of vehicle dynamics revolves around the two functions these functions are understanding the behavior of the vehicle under the certain driver input example turning the steering wheel or pressing the brake pedal too hard okay so basically if you are using the steering wheel and you are turning your vehicle and you find out that the car is not turning in the proper turning radius so you have to correct your wheel steering angles for the turning similarly if you are pressing the brake pedal or the accelerator pedal too hard for the braking and acceleration then you have to correct them too so that's the study of vehicle dynamics so study and verify if the vehicle response is safe and comfortable to the passenger sitting inside so occupant and the passenger should feel safe while sitting inside your car so that also comes under vehicle dynamics so now let's see the flow chart of vehicle dynamics so this is the driver and vehicle interaction so here you are the driver or anyone else's driver you are interacting with your right you are interacting with your vehicle so you are interacting with the vehicle you are giving some input you are interacting with it and what you are getting you are, you are getting some output or the responses so you get some responses according to the response you get you are finding that there are such some errors so you are going to do the modifications and the person sitting with you will have the effect on that you are pressing too hard they will feel the jerk so the effect on the occupant okay so understanding the vehicle dynamics can be accomplished at two levels these levels are the first level is the empirical level the second is the analytical level so the empirical level is basically the trial and error method this is a non-engineering approach here the person do the trial and error things and he gets some outputs this generally leads to failure okay so the empirical method is the trial and error method which often led to failure so you are doing trial and errors and this led to failures okay so don't try it analytical method is generally followed as it based upon the laws of physics analytical method is basically the mathematical models they are the set of equation that follows the laws of physics you are inputting and getting some outputs so it's an engineering approach and this is the correct way of handling vehicle dynamics fine so analytical method uses the mathematical modelings to get the outputs from some inputs so basically you are giving some inputs so the driver input, steering, brake, acceleration, etc. You are giving the inputs to what? The mathematical models. So mathematical models are the set of mathematics equations which follows the laws of physics. And what you get out of them? You get some outputs. The outputs are the responses. Okay. So this is what you get. So vehicle dynamics study can be classified under three major categories. Three major categories are there. Longitudinal dynamics, the study of the behavior of the vehicle in the straight line that is during the acceleration, braking, straight line stability. The second is the lateral dynamics. Okay, the study of the behavior of the vehicle taking the turn. Okay, you are taking the turn or during the overtaking, the lateral force is involved in it. Fine. The next is the vertical dynamics. The vertical dynamics is the study of the behavior of the vehicle in the simple, though in the vertical direction. So the study of the behavior of the vehicle in the vertical direction that is when you encountering a speed breaker or a puddle etc. So basically the vertical dynamics the road holding capacity is measured. Fine. So that's the vertical dynamics. So this is the category. This much for this video. Thanks for watching. And if you like my video, like my content, hit the like button. And if you find this video useful, do share with the colleagues, your friends and everyone. Let everyone know about the vehicle dynamics and the last don't forget to subscribe my channel okay hit the bell icon to get the latest updates and if you want to check my blogs on vehicle dynamics automobile softwares 
go and check on my website the link is in description box till then keep learning keep exploring